Hey everyone, I'm Sherry, and today we are here again with another segment of Vivant Skin Smart Series. Uh, today we are here with Vanessa Campa, Senior Research Chemist here at Vivant Skin Care. Perfect. Um, and today she's going to teach me and you a little bit more about vitamin A, uh, specifically our Vivant Skincare Vitamin A. Uh, so let's get into it. So tell me more about our, our vitamin A. So the vitamin A that we use here at Vivant Skincare is vitamin A propionate. Mm -hmm. um, and that one is pretty much a little bit different from the vitamin A that you would get at your dermatologist office. Okay. Um, dermatologists prescribe uh, Retin-A, mm -hmm. which is... Um, pretty much 20 carbons, it's a retinoid with 20 carbons, and it penetrates rather quickly, and some people tend to have redness, um, you know, reactions to, you know, your anesthetician, right. so you would mm -hmm. know what reactions they would yeah. get to a retin-A, whereas our vitamin A propionate mm -hmm. um, has 23 carbons, okay. and just those extra three carbons um, allow it to penetrate at a slower rate, mm -hmm. thus less irritation, um, but still the same excellent effect. Okay. And um, I'm not sure if you know, but vitamin A is great for acne, um, and it's also great for rejuvenation mm -hmm. and collagen production mm -hmm. and cellular turnover, so it's really, really an awesome key ingredient. Um, also, the difference between our vitamin A and other industry-used vitamin A is that it's the closest one that exists right. to prescription-based. Right. Um, other industries uh, uh, use vitamin A is vitamin A palmitate, mm -hmm. and that one has 36 carbons. So we go from 20 to 23 to 36. 36 is metabolized by the skin. Uh, vitamin A palmitate is mm -hmm. metabolized, and but at a much, much slower rate. Right. So depending on concentration used, um, really the penetration is, is, is very, very minimal. Right. Um, and the effects, you know, the results wouldn't be as quickly as you would right. see it with, Absolutely. with vitamin A propionate. Um, so pretty much that's it. Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> so me as an esthetician, when I'm educating my uh, clients on why you don't need a prescription, but it gives you the same, almost the same results right. as a Retin-A that you do need a prescription mm -hmm. for, how do I then explain to them that this will give you the result that you want without needing the prescription? Well, it's really awesome. That's mm -hmm. an excellent question. And the truth is that uh, retinol propionate is considered an old FDA okay. approved drug. So okay. it used to need prescription, okay. um, but now it doesn't anymore. Mm -hmm. And um, really the way I like to explain it to someone that's not you know, in a lab, yeah, I know, I know. not uh -huh. geeky like me, is um, pretty much you don't need a, a prescription mm -hmm. because it's a different molecule. Okay. So it's a derivative of. Okay. So your your skin is absorbing it, and it has to go through a couple extra steps mm -hmm. to reach what the retinol, uh, you know, in, in essence, just putting retinol directly on your skin. Okay. So vitamin A propionate um, is absorbed and then turned into retinol and okay. then turned into retinoic acid. Okay. So it's okay. like an extra step. Okay. Um, oh, that makes so much sense. That's so easy. It yeah. breaks down really, really well. Right, right. So you okay. have to take one more step. Mm -hmm. Thus, in S, you know, it's it's really great because that extra step allows for your skin to absorb it mm -hmm. and not to have that harsh reaction that right. some people receive with Retin-A. Right. right. And then they call you and like, oh, my skin's falling off. Mm -hmm. Okay. Perfect. Awesome. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Vanessa, for it's letting me know what vitamin A is <laughs> and also our views as well. Uh, so once again, I'm Sherry here with Vanessa, and it's another segment of Skin Smart Series.